Welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Commando QS4. You always score with Commando QS4. Okay, so we've advanced the timeline a couple of days. I want to go ahead and take this one other mission on this planet. There's a three and a half skull um, destroy base mission, which we're going to take with the mainlands, I think. Yeah, everything else that's been propagating has been like above five skulls, so we're not getting much else out of here. Uh, but I did decide, after I had a look at uh, some of the comments um, in the last two like two episodes ago, I think it was, that this mission here, the, um, the uh, what's it called? Um, oh my god, you know what I'm talking about. This mission, <laughs> this flashpoint here, apparently it's um, designed that you're supposed to uh, get a, a quad mech after this. Now I think it's because it's test drive. I think we're testing their mechs out. Someone had mentioned that we don't take our own; we test theirs. So I think I'm going to pop over here and try this one because it would be interesting to get a quad mech for the uh, for the third lance. So I think we'll do that. Uh, like it's 173 days away, but definitely at some point in the next little while, we'll pop over there real quick and do that one. Now it's, how far away is that? 25 days. So I mean, we're not going to get, well, we might get a mission for the main, like the, sort of the heavy lance when we're there, because it's, well, maybe we won't. We just have to pop in and do it and pop out again. But today we're not going to worry about that. Uh, let's go to the uh, command center. We're going to straight up take this mission and get going here. All right, let's negotiate. Full salvage. We're doing okay for sea bills. So, I mean, we could pop over there, do it, and pop away. It's going to be like a couple of million to do it, but we're getting a mech out of it, like a quad mech guarantee. Well, technically, it's supposed to be guaranteed. Whether it is or not, I don't know. And thank you, um, I believe it's Richard, mentioned that it's the possibility of these being screwed up as I haven't stored my vehicles and brought them back yet. Uh, so that's probably the case. Because we've only got a couple days to the end of the month, I'm actually not going to do that at this moment. But I will do it in the future, like between, like as we're going to the next planet, I'll store them all and bring them all back, uh, just so that they get updated with the new, um, with the new uh, affinities and stuff. So that could be what's causing the screw up here. So let's just load this. Uh, we want to go to Jenkins. Apply. Yeah, see this lance is okay. It's just the other ones that are a bit of an issue. Right? Scooter. Yeah, everyone's good to go. Now, the Panther um, was also mentioned, too, that the um, that the Tier 3 patchwork materials on here are basing us, basically giving us a, um, like, what is it, 0. 0.22 tons or something of space that we can't use. Uh, and I agree, if I had a smaller, um, if I had a smaller uh, patchwork materials, like a Tier 2, I would probably drop that in instead. But I don't have any of that, unfortunately, and I would rather leave that in there and stay with full armor, uh, because the enemies have been doing a lot of backstrikes lately, and we've got, like, I mean, we got light enough armor as it is on these things, so I'd rather ha make sure it's at full at all times, if I can. So that's the kind of the reason why I'm kind of leaving it in there. If we can find patchwork materials tier 2, that would be perfect. Uh, we would still be slightly underweight, like by 0.2 tons or something, point, sorry, 0 0.02 tons. Um, but that's that's negligible. So anyway, let's just go and get this done. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Command interface initiated. All right, let's see what we got. Target near bear base. And this is the valley map. Okay. All right. Showers might improve cooling a bit, eh? They might, or they might not. I think normally we're supposed to start over here. Um, but let's go, like, back here. Let's go after the base. I don't know what we're up against. I mean, mech-wise, I mean, we could go here, but then we'd be targeted by all mechs that are here, plus some of the turrets. So if we go here, hopefully we can kill the turrets before 
they get a chance to do anything. Uh, let's put them there like that. Hopefully we're hitting enough from the turrets. I don't know. We should be able to pull a couple of them down quick, I think. Looks right, like they've got a direct fire turret here and there. Heavy LRM turret. we got to kill that fast. LBX emplacement. Probably a pair of 10s, maybe, or 20s? Those are probably 15s. That's a light... So a pair of light Gauss rifles and a sniper turret, which is probably... What, AC2s, you figure? Strider. Maelstrom. And there's probably a couple more lurking somewhere. Uh, which I can't see right now. What's up, boss? All right, let's see if we can kill that LR... Oh, my God, we're going to be exposing to everything here. So that's the... LBX emplacement. That's the Goss turret can see us there. Oh, can we get a shot at that one turret without the other seeing us? No, they got good coverage. What about the Goss turret? Well, if we come here, we might be able to kill both of these. What do you got? 320? And you got you got Parabellar M20, so that's got to go. Or are they going to rain shit down on us? Um, all right, let's move to this side and see if we can get both of these turrets early. Either way, we're probably going to take some damage this turn. So let's bring the rotaries up. Um, let's bring the ultras. Uh, let's go with the ultra light at the top. And let's wind them up. Oops. There we go. And let's get as much damage as we can on this turret here as fast as we can. Wow, we only got four. The Rex lasers are like... No damage. Fire. Long range. Okay, that's good damage. Over half. Nice. About two-thirds of the uh, armor is gone. I don't think we'll be able to get both turrets this turn. I don't think we got the juice for both. Ready for orders. But we might. You never know. All right, let's get you down as far as possible. No matter what, both turrets are going to see us. So let's get into here. Aye, aye. Get as much evasion as possible. We've got another thing on there. Longinus? Okay. And a Shadowhawk. Alright, so not bad. It could be worse, but we're going to go all in on this guy. See if we can take it down. Well, we got it. I think we critted it out, actually. Target eliminated. Because we didn't do enough damage, physical damage, but we probably did enough crit damage to kill the uh, engine's turret, or turret's engine, I mean. Cool, which means we still got four units to go after the other turret. That's as far as you can get, huh? Well, we're going to do that. You haul your ass over there. That's a pretty nice chance to hit. Go up with this one. Yeah, I still have to go in and set this in my... Um, uh, inside the uh, the mech base to uh, which order I want stuff to be in, but I'm getting there. Oh, and they got the TSM thing set up here too, which is kind of nice. All right, we'll fire it all. Here we go. Firing full complement on. Oof, that's a lot of damage. What do you need? All right, Junker, uh, can you get a shot in that turret? You can. There. There. I'm going to go here. Understood. Moving it's going to put me more in the open. If I go on the hill, I might get a slightly better chance to hit, but I want to be moving, so let's get out here. That's not too bad. We'll fire it all. Aye, aye. Yeah, so the heavy PPC... Hit. I mean, it, um, there's been a couple comments about the heavy PPC. It's not... Um, that's a Marauder, isn't it? Wait. Maelstrom MTR 5K. It looks like a Marauder. All right. Well, sure. We'll take it. Standing by. Uh, but yeah, the heavy PPC. It's one of those weird weapons that's like. Okay, we can go here. We're shooting kind of past our guys. Let's do it. That it's like. At, it does great damage at long range, but you got a garbage chance to hit. And then it, you get a good chance to hit when you get closer, but it does like no damage. So it's 
One of those weird things that's like... There we go. Two threats neutralized. One left target. All right, talented Commander. Mr. Ripley. Let's get you up here. We're not going to shoot this turn. We're just going to move up. Double time. Let's get in go. the strike range. So it's like, I mean, it's okay, I guess, but... The other two heads are parts that we have. One is the uh, Thunderbolt 20. Ow. Losing armor. I guess destroying this turret made it easy for that guy to see me, maybe? I don't know, because we we weren't getting a... Um, Waiting for orders. I guess so. Yeah, that turret gone. They can now... I think they can see me. Shitty. Oh well, whatever. No problem. Let's go after way. that last turret. Well, last the turret that we can see then. This guy. Leave the light rotary on. Enemy structure damage, Commander. Oh, we hit a building with something. But yeah, that that large heavy um, PPC. It's great if you're standing way back and you got a great chance to hit. But if you don't, they will be done. It really is one of those weapons that's really situational. So. You kind of got to take that into account if you're going to use it. Because we haven't been getting really any um, good chances to hit with it or good use out of it yet. Man, I got to remember, uh, this mech is like... <sighs> we can get a pair of LRM-10s, it might be better. Or right, you know what, I may want to switch these two out for an MRM loadout. Because we're not getting the range, so... There we go. Got a bit more damage in the building. Totally meant to do that. Because that would have been perfect MRM range. Commander. So with 10... Hmm. We have 6 tons plus a ton and a half for On ammo. You're going to be fine, I think. We'll just shoot this. We should be able to kill this turret. Come on. Yes. Pulse it out. Target eliminated. Beautiful. Where are you going? There's no way up over there, buddy. Orders. No way up over there. Ooh, we're gonna get a shot at this guy. Might as well do it. We're just gonna walk up. On my way. Take a pot shot at this guy. Ah, uh, yeah, we'll leave the combat shotgun on. Thought we were going to get more resistance. But, I mean, I don't know. Yeah. Three and a half. We haven't been getting really good, uh... Let's just go here. Shoot the building. We haven't been getting good opposition in, uh... From the enemies. Let's go with this one first. Clear this side Roger. out. Ah, nice, we hit. Waiting for orders. So, do you have? Oh man, do I do it and then like maybe hit this guy? Let's uh, vigilance, and then let's sprint up to here. And try something a little crazy. Enemy oh shit. Where? Okay. I heard the dropship and I thought they were dropping behind us. I was going to be like, oh my god, we're going to die. So we're going to target this guy. And I think we'll probably hit him. Let's see. Maybe. I don't know. Roger. See ya. Okay, that's broken. That's got to be broken. Is he dead or is he just... Oh, he's just down. Oh, wait. Yeah, we took his whole side. I think we must have double hit the torso. Yeah, probably. Standing by. Sucks to be you. Well, let's just move over here. We're going to take these buildings. Gonna drop some heat here before we move up and drop our recoil. So we'll just fire lasers only. Combat shotgun can go off. Um, 
Let's just leave the pul those off. We'll just hit it with the pulse laser. Can't create a building. But assuming that the, the pulse is shooting through all the windows and killing all the Order. killing all the people inside, so that's good enough for crit. Alright, drop and recoil again. So we will just fire the two Rex lasers and do a bit of damage to this thing. Taking the shot. Two hits. Well, I said 21 each, but it, the Rex was saying 32. What's up, boss? Let's just pull back here. Get ready for another strike. Yeah, machine guns unjammed. We're in good strike range. These are the guys that have me the worried the most, though. Oh, okay. I thought he was getting to a position where he could shoot, but I guess not. Ready for orders. All right, big sex. Let's get up to here. Acknowledged. Don't think we're going to be able to get a shot at that. Uh, leave that off. Just fire the lasers. Target acquired. At that strider on the ground. He's down behind the hill there. I kind of got to crest the hill to get a shot at him. Yeah, he's looking at a little divot there. Arctic Wolf. Why do they, Why does the Tamron Abbey have so many clan mechs? Is it like one of those clan refu refuges or something? Ref refuges? God, I can't even talk today. It's Friday for me. Come on. Send me a real mech warrior. Medium group heavies and clan sixes. Yeah, maybe I I gotta look into maybe swapping out those um, the two SRMs on this thing and going to with uh, medium. Ooh, do we want to go after the guy in the ground? I think I do. Going going on after a um, an MRM loadout. I'm gonna go vigilance here so we can get ahead of some of these guys. So what do you got? ER PPC, ER large, large. I can't even fucking talk. Two medium pulses and a small laser. Or we just go for the kill. Get rid of this guy completely. An arc launcher tag. He doesn't have much, but let's just try and get rid of this guy. One less thing I have to worry about. Engaging target. Yeah, there we go. We got the tools. We, can salvage that. we got the talent. Yep. We can salvage that. I don't really hope we can salvage it. I don't really care. I don't care. Okay, can we get a hill? I mean, we could try. Wow, it's really low chance to hit. Good damage. 62 damage, but 13% chance to hit. Or even if we're a little closer, it's 20% chance to hit for 30 damage. It's like... It's brutal. Alright, let's just pull up here. Let's move. This thing would be far more effective if that uh, heavy PPC was a snub. Let's go after this thing. Here we go. If it was a snub, it would be great. Right? Then you could up the engine, because it wouldn't weigh as much. Up the engine a little bit, maybe up the armor a tiny bit. A snub and a, and a uh, streak four would be kind of nice together. Now, the Shadowhawk, fuck him. Although, what version is this? The 5S. That's a lot of energy weapons. So do we just forget him now and just try and kill this guy up here? I think so. Let's move up here. I'm going to switch to acid ammo, see if we can get a, get a little bit of acid on this guy. Um, you know what? The funny thing is, is every time I look at the pilots between episodes, I keep forgetting I've got, like... It's not going to make a difference for this guy. But I keep forgetting that I should be doing this, like, with all of my pilots. And I, I just haven't been using their skills. I've been taking them and then not using them at all. Okay, strip a bit of armor. So if, even if I get used to using it on this guy, standing by, it'll hopefully let me use it on the other guys as well. Alright, we want to get... To the side of that Bomber, rotor. Full speed. We want to bring our rotaries back online. Now, do you have Warlord? You got. So that's really the wrong. 
We don't want the warlord on this thing. All right, let's fire. Affirmative. Okay, not bad. Could have been worse. He's going on 14. Are we still ahead of him a bit here? Do we have anybody else? We've got Scooter coming in. Big Tex is coming in. Okay. Then our vehicles. I'm here. Okay, boot Scooter. Let's get up over here. I'm going to walk it over because I want to drop that uh, instability. Now you, I don't think you've got... Oh, you do. Not that it's going to matter. See, now this guy should be... This guy should have rotaries. I got the pilots in the wrong max, but unfortunately... Holy shit. That guy's leg's almost gone. Wait, that's me. Shit, what the fuck am I... That guy must have double hit me in the leg. Alright, well... I'm an idiot. I call I don't know what the hell I was thinking. Good thing I got stealth, eh? Well, we know who's taking the backstrike. Armor breach. Internal damage. You've already got an armor breach. That guy's taking a backstrike. Oh, Scorpion back there. Standing by. Maybe we'll get the quad mech and not have to go to that, uh... Flashpoint. Yeah, fuck Spotted. this guy. No shooting, just running. Fuck this guy. That's just the Arctic Wolf, it looks like it. Okay, do I have... I do. Control bursts. Lower my chance for jamming. Hammer him. Oh, man. How you like me now? Solid connection on that one. Maybe he'll run. He's going on 14 still, and our vehicle's going to go after him. Okay. So we'll see what he does. He might move forward. He might. Yep, he's going to move forward. Who's he going to target, though? That's the question. Oh, good. Okay. Target the armor. You could have got a kill in the Valkyrie if you'd gone after him, maybe. Took a hard hit there. You did. Yes, Commander. Mr. Ripley, you have the tools. You have the talent. Let's not shoot with it where our guys are in the way. And we'll be down the hill. Yeah, we'll go right there. Because we're down the hill a little bit. Less chance of them seeing us. 47% chance to hit. Hopefully we land. I got me. Nope. Good machine gun hits, though. Yeah. Misfire. Misfire! 20%, huh? A little better on this guy, though. Can we get a back shot? We, we can. Because fuck him. Out. We'll take the back shot. This guy wants to push in and attack us. We'll shoot him. Firing. No, he won't. We'll pretend like we're going to shoot him. Missed. But then we won't. Okay, he goes on 15. We got 18, 16. You're on 14, 16. So we're, all, we're ahead of everybody. You're on 15. Let's see if we can push this guy's initiative back. Uh, it's not going to matter, though, because the Hetzer's not going to be able to kill him. The Panther might be able to get... If we can get everybody on a backstrike on this guy, we could probably pull him down. Ready for orders. The question is, can we? This would push his initiative back, but... Is it really going to... What's it going to do for us, really? Because nobody else is going to get be able to get behind him. Well, that's not bad. Good chance of hitting our own guy, though. I'm going for the kill. I'm greedy. We got our mech with really bad, badly damaged legs, so we're going to go for the kill. All right. Um, going to dial you back. All right. We warlorded last turn. Dialing you back. We'll just shoot him. Locked on. Rear armor. Okay. Nice. Got past the armor. 
Hopefully it's it's a uh, torso. And we'll get you to do a precision strike. I'm being blank. So, Alright, you're only going to be there for this turn. That's those little turd burglars too. Okay. Got their ECCM on. Where are you going? Up the hill. Orders. Okay, scooter. Let's get ahead of them next turn. God, this is such a risk. We should be fine, I think. Right? I'm not making a mistake here. We're, 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 we're fine, right? Targeting for an outward strike. Somebody was running XL. Tango down. God, that p -p -p pulse laser is insane. With the double energy crits. Oh, wait, is that another Marauder? Bandersnatch, Horus. Didn't we fight? Oh, he's got two AC-20s. 75 tons. That's not good. We're going to have to kill that guy I'm really ready. fast. Like, he shows up and then he's dead. That's how fast he's got to go down. Now, the question is, is do I keep... Uh, you're on 14. We go before you on 15, 15, 13... I keep the acid on. I don't think so. We just go standard on this one. I'm gonna. I gotta save the ans the uh, acid for that Horus. So let's see if we can just smash this guy real quick here. Targeted for now. Okay. Good damage. Engine crit. Critical hit. It's not good for energy boats. Scorpion. One BP. Yes, Commander. All right, let's back up on to here. I'm gonna leave the rotary on, cause you know, fuck him. And I think we used our, yeah, we used our thing last turn. So let's just hammer this guy. Hopefully, we do some good damage to him. We got, some, we've already got some good damage in on him. So. Oh, see ya. Hope we can salvage that. Receiving you. Well, he was bleeding out. Now he's just, you know, not having a good day. Get the machine guns on these guys. So their missiles are gone. They got the ballistics left. I don't want to expose that turret, though. How do I get a shot at that uh, their turret blossom without exposing to the turret? I don't think I can. So you know what? Let's go. Let's do this. Let's just back up. On my way. We gotta drop our recoil anyway, so let's just do that. We'll back up and we'll wait a turn. Aye aye. And Junker, just pull over here. Confirmed. And we'll shoot this. It's only 17 damage, but whatever. Such a waste of a friggin' like ten ton Ready weapon. Alright, we get it we got ahead of them, so let's get out of there. Back up to here. I call me. Gonna drop our uh, heat here. And we'll drop you. Well I was good with the pulse. We should kill it. Target sight. Demolished. Excellent. Oof. Weapon system down. What did we lose? Something. Somebody's jumping. Rex laser. Damn it. I don't have any left. You can't get up there, guys. I tried. Oh, Cephalus. So he's the, he's the additional guy. 
Mr. Zappy, that's not good. Waiting for orders. No, we're not gonna hit this guy. Can we? Where are those little shit burgers? Where'd they go? Roger. Full speed. Wait, are they on me? They are. I didn't even notice it. Shit, I didn't notice it. Oh, that's bad. can't do anything about it now. Wait, erratic maneuvering? Does that... Let's see if we can drop them. Mm, I think I gotta do it before I move. Shoot. Well, not much I can do about it now. Standing by. It's so rare that I get mounted by... Oh, mounted. That I get those guys getting on top of me. I have to wait. This guy's going on right. So I'm finishing my turn out. So let's get into here. Position confirmed. I want this turret. Give me more freedom of movement on this side. So let's see if we can kill it real quick here. Got it. Oh, I missed with an 80 some odd percent chance to hit. I'm here. I can't believe I missed with like an 80 something percent chance to hit. Acknowledged. Oh, sorry, I can believe that. It's gotta be like 16 or something before I'm able to hit. Good to go. She just like runs by uh, metal there. Well, it's nice knowing you. Don't fucking lose the mech. That's not too bad. We'll pull up in here. Take a shot at that Cephalus. Uh, let's drop our recoil. Okay, nice shots. Commander? Well, I can't help you, unfortunately, so... Let's just move up. Our guy's like directly behind him too. Damn it! Well, locking in all weapons. Okay, I got a little bit of damage on that guy. Someone let me borrow their pom poms and skirts because I'm damn excited now. Oh, oh, fuck! I lost a weapon. And the patchwork. Well, so much for the rotary building that guy. Well, I think I got another ultralight kicking around. I don't know if I have ammo though. It's all in the arm too, like. That's the, that's the problem with those rotaries, is the ammo has to be in the location that the uh, weapon's in. Ah, I didn't see him get on top of me. Damn it. Well, I'll figure out a new build for the guy. Standing by. Uh, alright. Um... Reserve. Order. You. So we do erratic maneuvering. And then we move to like... No matter where we go, it's not going to be far enough away from those guys. We can go there. They dropped off. Okay. So we should... If everybody goes against these guys this turn, hopefully do some damage to them. Engaging with target. Nice hit. Receiving you. All right, everybody on those guys. I fucking hate these things. Acknowledged. That's a pretty good chance to hit, though. I wonder if that's because they didn't. Maybe they're technically prone now. Probably. 
Either way, we're gonna... Oh my god, this guy's like right in the way. Too bad. They don't like that very much. Reporting critical hit. Orders? No. Yep. Copy that. Don't know how many machine guns I got left, but we're gonna use them on this guy while we're dropping recoil and everything else. Oh yeah, there we go. On it. Death by MG. Inflicted some heavy damage. Standing by. Let's see if we can get you the kill here. On my way. And then we can use the uh, Vindicator on the um, Cephalus. Hopefully we land the shot here. Okay, I'm on. Target nice. Hostile removed. They did their job though. Standing by. They did their job. Let's engage that guy. What's up, punk? Oh, good. Crappy chances to hit, but we'll take it. Or I could ping him and then let the, um... How is this guy for armor? It's not... It's only gonna give me, like... It's only gonna give me a handful of extra percentage to hit, so... Let's just see if we can hit him with whatever we can. I'm here. And then hopefully Scooter can do something here. Let's see what we can do. See if we can get something in on this guy. Nice. Reporting. Critical hit. Arms don't have anything in it, but whatever. Okay, he's gonna go before us. Yeah, so these guys are stuck down here. They can't get up. Not exactly sure why. I wonder if there's a way to go in to the maps and fix some of the terrain so it makes it easier for the mechs to get around. Like the AI mechs. Yes, Commander. Okay, just walk. We gotta kill this guy first before we do anything. God, the chance to hit here. Might as well just fire the rack, it's no heat. Alright, we land well we landed two. Nice. Orders. I'm not sure if you noticed that, but that this is where that that marauder was. We hit, actually hit the marauder several times. At least that's what it looked like. And I'm, I'm thinking that they got us I don't know, maybe I I don't know. It's that that it's the chance to hit if you're missing your current opponent seems to be too large. Target's taking a critical hit. Orders. Let's get a little extra percentage. Whoops. A little extra percentage just by just getting up here. Moving to position. Just by getting up here in the open. Couple of engine crits. Like did some heavy damage. What's up, boss? Well, I mean, he is in here by himself, so like, you got balls, kid, but you're stupid. I copy. Let's hang on to that. Acknowledged. Got a feeling we're gonna need it. A double AC twenty mech is good. It's just. I'm here. It's terrifying me at this moment. God, it's so bad. Let's move. Sure. Aye, aye. Engaging target. Nothing. Oh, crap. Missed. I mean, we still have the double 20, but they've technically got a double 20 as well. All right, talented Mr. Ready Ripley. We've got four turns of firing left. I'm just going to use machine guns on this guy, I think. All 
All right, Got see it. if we can get some crits. I think, yeah, this thing's a double XL engine. Target neutralized. Minimal damage on that hit. So it's better that we do that. Get the crits, get the kill. Now we got to go get the turret. So turret, base turret, and then these guys. Ooh, uh, somebody's up on the top. Oh, it's that guy. Ow. Not much armor left in that location. Losing armor. That's okay. Let's strip that guy's armor too. Go with the side shot. This guy's like not doing well. Just shoot it. Trying to put his head down. No joy. Yeah, you're not going to have any joy for a while, I don't think. Orders. All right, Big T. Can't get a side shot on him, eh? We can there. This is the big gun, too, so I don't know what the chance the hit's going to be. Oh, it's actually pretty good. Moving out. All right, my turn. You had your turn. Now it's my turn. Lost evasive. You are in trouble. I can't get another side shot on him, can I? I can there, but I exposed the turret. I don't want to do that. Get to here. Primitive. Let's not let that turret get a shot at us. Standard ammo firing. Okay, there's the knockdown. And he's bleeding out. Commander. You get a shot at him. Position confirmed. You get a shot at him, and you get a shot at him. Now, what do we want to shoot? I think I want clan parts from this guy. I mean, we could go after his head. Yeah, with the pulse laser, we, we, we might get a shot on his head. Let's try it. Wow. I think we got more than one hit in his head there. Because didn't he... Yeah, he would have taken one wound from the fall. And that's pretty much it. So he must have taken two from the pulse. Good to go. I don't know if you can do that, can you? Can you double crit somebody that way? Maybe you can. Location confirmed. I don't know. Whatever. He's done. That's all that matters. That's a pretty good chance to hit. Although we had the same chance last time. A pair of AC fives, eh? Acknowledged. Oh, for fuck's sakes! Aye, aye. I think somebody needs to spend a little bit more time in the simulator. Uh, that's the left side. Copy that. Oh man. Hits, but almost no damage. It's fine. Receiving you. All right, Arcelor Metal. Don't shoot the Hetzer. Everybody should go ahead of this turret, I think, so. Let's drop the recoil on the rack. Locking on target. You can still do some damage. 54. Nice. Waiting for orders. If those guys had jump jets, we'd be in a lot of trouble, but, you know, they don't. Hooray for us. Position confirmed. Uh, how badly damaged are you? Uh, let's leave these off. I've got a feeling I'm going to need the ammo. Ooh, we've only got one shot left in the combat shotgun, too. Locked and loaded. Now that I'm looking at this Ready thing, the Vindicator... The loadout seems underwhelming now compared to like the 35 tonners. I may have to reanalyze that. See what we can squeak in there. Maybe we go for the rotary build on that guy and. I don't know. Just hammer him. That should do it, yeah. 
I need more of those pulse lasers. Okay, so it's going to take me a while to get around here to be able to fight these guys. So I'm going to destroy the buildings as I go, but then I'll co probably come back when I'm around here because this is going to get real boring real fast. All right, looks like we're almost ready to get into the fight here. We're pretty darn close to seeing them. I'm here. I'm just worried that, like, we can get into the fight, but... Oh, man, I gotta get, like, everybody on this guy at once, so... You're actually faster than everybody else. Let's just back up over on here. It's not exposed yet. Aye, aye. This guy's gotta walk. Roger. This guy's just gonna be shooting from long range anyway. Not much we can do about it. Okay, Scorpion. Oh, he's getting a shot off, though. Systems holding. Waiting for orders. Are they not recycling for another shot? I'm gonna go with the ping this turn. Because I don't think we'll get a chance to use it after. Nothing. Ready for orders. I mean, do I want it? I think we're going to vigilance this. What turn? Where are we on 19? Oh, you know what? They haven't gone yet. The banner snatch hasn't gone yet. Am I in range, though, for the, the 20s? I am, I think. I think the 20s are in range here. Oh, I can't risk it either. On my way. I can't risk it. If he comes around that corner and hammers me, even with 120, it's going to be bad. Confirmed. Okay. Orders. Because I'm a greedy bastard, ass. we're going to take the shot. We're only, really only going to get one or two shots with this thing at the most. 34. We've missed with less. Or we've hit with less, I mean. Let's see how you like this. Oh, we hit one on each of them. You guys saw that, right? One on each. No. This guy took both. This guy took the damage. Damn it. Yeah, Let's see, that's up. way too high. Like, the damage pretend, like, output is way too high on those guys. So they're going on 24. What are you on? 28? Let's reserve. Roger that. Standing by. Let's let that guy go first. He's probably going to go after the Hetzer. Ah! Fuck. Let's hope he's not dead. Oh, God. We have to go for the best chances to hit here. All right, let's get try and get a knockdown here, or at least take one of the... Oh, no, we're hitting them on the front. Oh, that's nice damage. Critical hit, Commander. Bye. You gotta get out and forward, well, out as far as you can, not necessarily forward, but you gotta get every, out of everybody's way. Let's move. We all gotta shoot, and it's all gonna be on this guy. We've only got one uh, cluster round left, so let's hope the ashes splash as well here. Firing on target. Nice. Okay, there goes his arm. Target's taking a critical hit. AC5 ammo depleted. Let's put you up here. Location confirmed. We're going all in. Hopefully we get something here. Locked on. Alright, nice. Not bad. 
inflicted some heavy damage. You can see the increased damage, like like we got an extra couple points per hit for the acid. Yeah. Uh okay. That's fine. That was the tough Panther. Reporting major armor lock. Commander. At least it was you. Hate saying it like that, but it's, it's true. We might hit the uh scorpion, but we'll just try and get this guy. Oh, there's the kill. And this guy took damage too. Tango that's bullshit. Down. They gotta get that that's gotta change. I'm here. As much as I enjoy getting that extra damage in or whatever, that has to change because that's just broken. That's way okay, too many confirmed. hits. Like if you want to hit somebody, just position them between somebody that you're shooting and I'm taking the shot. And um then just fire at the guy behind them and you'll hit the guy in f like you know what I mean? It's just dumb. Ready for orders. Just straight up dumb. Anyway. I copy. It should be like a really low it should be the same percentage that well even less, like half the percentage that you have you hit the guy behind him. Acknowledged. You roll in the guy behind and if you miss then half of the percentage of whatever that chance was could get applied to the guy that's directly Great between orders. you. And then for every hex or whatever away, Confirm. that percentage is like, you know, turned to a quarter of that, right? Or something like that. Just like really turns it way down. Solid connection on that one. I never did understand the the uh, the uh, thought behind the quad mech because if you take the two legs off on the one side, it can't get up and do anything. Acknowledged. Like I mean, it, it can't shift the weight to the other two legs. It just can't do it. But whatever. You're gonna kill him here anyway. There we go. Finally. Mech destroyed. Oh, there it is, folks. Mission successful. Well, I took a really big gamble with that Hetzer, but I thought we had to do it. Here's the thing, like he would have wrecked one of my mechs. The Hetzer has a better chance to come back fully intact. Look at the kills in the Valkyrie. Those are the pulse laser kills too, a lot of these. Like, look at that. That's insane. Oh, he was killed in action. Damn it. I guess that death gurgling scream was uh <sighs> Well I risked it. Didn't come out on top, unfortunately. Although there's a full bandersnatch and a full Arctic wolf. And a full cephalus. And a full maelstrom. Maelstrom's five laser. Banner snatch is what? Two ballistic, three laser, and... You know, this thing would be a nice candidate for a pair of light AC-20s. Somebody had mentioned doing a double light AC-20 build. Maybe on like an Orion or something, but this thing would be... Uh, a prime candidate for a double light AC-20 build. And this could go in the, uh, the Heavy Lance. Ooh. Torso mounted ER large laser. Endo. Is it an XL? It doesn't say. I'm imagining though if it had two. If it had two AC20s. It probably has a, a XL engine in it. Especially at 4.6 movement. The Maelstrom, like we don't have anything that can accept these. So I think we're going to do, I'm going to put these three in for now. Because we don't have any of those parts. Pair of ER Larges, ER PPC, light Gauss Rifle, LRM-20s, medium improved heavy lasers, which we've got three of already. Narc Launchers, medium pulses, Clan 6s, the Tazor. Minus 50% critical hit chance with this weapon. Movement reduced by 40% for two turns. 
Target accuracy reduced by two, minus two for two turns. It's nice to have that on the Cephalus for sure. Chameleon we've already got. Clan Endo. Clan XL. I should take this. The Clan Exchanger is nice too. We've already got one though. I should be taking this. Got to throw it in there for now. It's very rare we see it. Gallery support. And we've got the sea bills to start loading some of the uh, heavier mechs out with that. Like maybe we'd put a X Clan XL in this Bandersnatch. Uh, patchwork 1. We lost our our uh, other patchwork materials. Yeah, no, I think that's what we go with. Make it short and sweet. All right, we got an Arctic Wolf part, Shadowhawk part, two Shadowhawk parts. Three, we got a Shadowhawk. <laughs> Shit, that's not bad. ER large, medium improved heavy, medium laser diverse optics. We'll keep that guy. That's not bad. SRM6 streak we'll hold on to. We got a bunch of those. A pair more tags. How many tags do we have? Three. Let's just get rid of those. Taser we'll hold on to. I think we need ammo for that, don't we? It uses taser ammo. So if we don't have taser ammo, it's probably pretty useless. Don't need the jump jets. Double heat sinks. That can go. LBX ammo. I haven't been seeing a lot of LBX stuff lately. But yeah, you know, we'll hold on to the taser. We might find ammo at some point. So, but we got a whole Shadowhawk out of that too. That's not bad. All right, well, that sucks. Yeah, 100, yeah, that's a lot. That's a lot. At least we didn't lose the um, Hetzer. That's four now. This has been the roughest series I think I've ever played. Four pilots gone. That's that's brutal for me. But, I mean, I think that's a little... better. Like, it's more fair, I think, now. Because going through an entire career and never losing a pilot, if you have the system that Rogue Tech has now and you make it through and you don't lose a pilot, then it's, you feel like you've had an accomplishment, especially with all of the wounds, right? So losing four four pilots right now... Yeah, I feel sad about it, but it's like, it feels balanced, right? Because you're going to lose people. So, I, I mean, I don't I don't have anything negative to say about that. That's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's unfortunate, but we don't have anything negative to say. Now, I don't think there's anybody we want to grab out of here. we got to get another vehicle pilot, so let's have a look. My barracks here. Now, I did pick up another pilot. I didn't realize I had done that when I first arrived at the planet. I did pick up a pilot here. Yanissary, who's a mech pilot. Mech only pilot. So I mean, I guess Kodiak. Standing by. We could bring her up into the Prime Lance. Or maybe we bring up like Ready for orders. Somebody from one of the other lances. Megaflop might be actually the good pilot to bring up. Because we got the extra speed boost. And then we use... We swap Earthquake in for Mega Flop. And then Kodiak can also go into that Lance. Uh, Yanissary, I want to leave... I want to get her into Light Mech. Like a lighter mech. Like a lighter Scout mech. I'm not sure where that's going to go. Maybe it's going to be a third Lance. Or maybe it'll be a floater. Um, or if we get more than one Lance going at a time. Like, if we get able to drop two lances at once, maybe I can utilize her. Because she does have escapist, right? So definitely going to have to be in a lighter, light, like a lighter mech. And then with the uh, the tactics and stuff. So I want to see what I can do with that. Something like that's super stealthy and fast. And then have like a, like a narc launcher or a tag or a bunch of stuff on it like that. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I have to figure out who's going to get moved up. Probably going to be... Um, like I said, it's probably going to be a mega flop. We'll move her up. And then I think we might have to move... Um, we move Junker into the uh, other Hetzer. God, it's so unfortunate. But not much I can really do about it now. All right, let's go to the mech bay real quick before we leave. Got to bring that Marauder forward. 
I think we do that. And I think RIP, but I think uh, the Rabbit Coyote is going to get dropped for now. I don't think I'm going to go back to Melee. I I'm not... I've never really been a big Melee fan. So I think we're just going to leave it out. Uh, we'll just drop it out of play. I should do a Melee only... <laughs> Try and do, like, not necessarily melee-only series, but a series that's just all melee mechs and see how far I can get with it. So then you're going to come down there. Let's bring that 75-tonner forward. I mean, I could bring the Atlas forward, but I want to keep things roughly around the same weight currently. The Atlas will be will be up sooner or later. Uh, let's bring the Banner Snatch forward. See what we can get out of this. That mech you asked for is cleared for fighting. All right, well... Let's just see. Got both your arms. The CT's toasted. Nah, I didn't get much out of this. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we get. Well, we got one side. Uh, a little bit more on this side too, so I mean... Whatever. Yeah, I mean, if you're going to roll with two... It did have a, just a regular XL. I'm going to take the drop of clan XL on this thing. So this is a 75 tonner. So if we have a 300 core, I think we do. So it's a movement of four. And then what would it cost to drop the XL in there? Because we're going to need it. Like, pull these out for now. And then if we drop the Clan XL, it's probably going to be like, what, like 3 million? 5 million. Are you shitting me? I guess that's not happening anytime soon. What about a light engine? That's 3 million. What are we dealing with here, though? So the light AC-20s are 8 tons of pop. It's 16 tons. Plus at least 6 tons of ammo. We're going to want. So it's 22 tons. That brings us up to 65. And then some secondary weapons and a bit more armor maybe. What about... Um, I'll have to mess around with this off camera. It'll take a bit of work. I mean we could go with Feral Lamellar. Because it's going to be a brawler build. We want to reduce the damage, right? Can't, cased armor can't be used with case. So it is clan. I guess it's because it's clan armor. It does automatically has case built in. So that's a bonus. Yeah, case enabled. So we don't have to worry about case. And then we have... Um, we have clan endo. That leaves us lots of space left. Max the armor. We're at 3.5. So let's not completely max the armor, but like 60 maybe on each side. And then like 80 in the center. 85 in the center. 41 tons. Triple laser build. One missile, one support in the head. So we'd have to bring the... Um, Yeah, we'd have to bring the other, uh, I'd have to strip the, uh, 20s off the other mechs. Could go with the double 20 builds. <laughs> and then it would just be ammo and that would be all it would be. Nope, not doing that, unfortunately. Yeah, so we got another, we got another ultralight rotary rifle. I don't, I don't think I have ammo for it, though. That's why I was using the, um... Wait, Ultralight uses the periphery ammo. I think that's... I don't think I have any ammo left. I think I used it all, yeah. So it's not the Ultralight I was looking for. It's the light rotary rifle. Yeah. Oh, well. I mean, it's a possibility. I have to tweak the max. I think I'm better off... Oh, God, what do I do? Do I want to get this guy fully... Like, I mean, I could just do this. Shit, that's a lot. I 
You know, I think we can't jump. We can't jump and do that um, flashpoint because it's going to be one jump there. We're not going to be able to take any missions while we're there. Then we got to jump out. So that's like what three point eight million right there. So that leaves us with two million left. So we're going to have to not do that. So we'll repair this. Let's get this. Ah, fuck. Just do it. Just do it. Twenty-five days. Let's just get it in going. Fuck it. All right. Let's get, get that started. All right. I'm going to jump out of this system probably. Right. Or do I want to hang around? You know what I might do? we got two days to the financial report. I'll probably hang here to see what missions show up. And if we got something that we can do, we'll wait, get our guys back, and do missions here rather than jumping. Because that'll give us more time. Like, we'll give us a whole month of fighting. Do we get anything good? New? No. Yeah, you know what? We're at... I gotta go to a four skull planet, I think. I think I gotta look for a four. We're gonna jump. Forget it. We're jumping. Because we're at a four and a half right now. The best I can get is a three and a half. Which is like tough for our uh, primary lance right now. So this should be a four. Close by. Anyway, I'm going to... I'll figure out where we're going to go. I'll jump. Look for a four skull planet. Worst case scenario, three and a half. We're going to look for a four skull planet so we can get like level, uh, five skull missions. Um, and then we'll pick it up when we come back next time. But I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.